morning, everyone! Holy shnikes! It's like I barely got started and we all already got a raid. Thank you very much for the raid, Captain Zanzibar. Glad to bring you, um, uh, you and uh, six of your really cool friends with you. Yeah, I mean, I was, I mean, I just mentioned, oh yeah, I'm just gonna stream and I didn't. Okay, so what we're doing here is we're doing some grinding. Uh, we're doing, we're, essentially why we're grinding is because we've got, uh, we've got a pretty powerful monster that we need to fight. And, um, um, and so what, what I, what I usually do on grinding streams is I like to, um, I just like to chat. It's more of, you know, it's like more of just chatting. Um, we're, go we're going right for the Murphy's Ghost. Big waves. Thank you, Blind Immortal. Big waves. Pre appreciate you at least uh, dro dropping, uh, at least, uh, dropping on in. Okay, now, friendly group of unseen entities. Remember, we're wanting XP, so we're always going to fight. Okay. So when when I do grinding streams, I tend to it tends to be more it's it's usually less about the gameplay and more more about the entertainment. Um, now when when you're grinding, you wanna you wanna you wanna go through his monsters as quickly as possible. So we don't care about the timer. Now you all may be wondering why am I picking on Murphy's ghosts? Why, why am I picking on Murphy's ghosts? Um, decent experience. You know, we each got like 741 experience. Decent. Um, Murphy's ghosts have no special attacks. We don't have to worry about getting poisoned, paralyzed, stoned. Although, you know what? People will say they, they complain about being petrified. What's the big deal about getting stoned? Come on, that sounds like fun, actually. <laughs> Um, um, now, and, and they also, when they attack, they only, they only do, like, two hit points of damage per attack. So that's why I don't have to worry about, you know. Uh, but this is Wizardry 1. This is the NES version. Um, there's also other versions. I think there's a PC version. I think there's a Commodore version. But Captain Zans, I hope I hope you're hope you're getting hope you're uh, getting ready to cook a um, hope, hope hope you all are get re getting ready to have a good meal. I mean that's that's you know. I'm John Moody of uh, uh, Moody Mystery. Uh, Moody Mystery is my um, um, is my uh, is is the account which I stream on. I, I have that account. You may say, well, why? Um, why Moody Mystery? Be two reasons. Um, I'm obsessed with Scooby Doo. Love Scooby Doo. And I'm also. One thing, I, I was always obsessed. There was one mystery shot. It was like, I think, Black Knight. It's a tough mystery shot because it's essentially, you have to, like, um, it's the shot goes, like, the, it's through the left in lane, and then you have to hit it perfectly. And I was like, oh, it was, you know. And, and apparently, you know, it, I got known for that. People would sometimes, on you and I would go for that, people would say, Moody Mystery. So... doing well this evening. I'm, do, I'm doing, doing well. I just decide. I just honestly, I like this game, but I just, I just want to get it out of the way. You know, I want to. I, I just want, I just want to get it out of the way so I can. Um, but it's such a cool game. Notice is that the 
is that the first three characters, so when you're when you're in combat, the first only the first three characters can actually fight. You know, the ro characters four, five, and six, they're essentially in the back, and they can't, and they and all they can do is parry, or they can cast a spell, or they can use an item. I mean, there's other options. You know, um, that that being said, it was it's one of those things that they didn't fix until Wizardry Five, I believe. This is Wizardry One. They Wizardry Five. They actually introduced the concept of a wep of um of like extended range weapons and uh, and bows. So that that's so that that's why it's why it seems you know f uh, f you know funny um, about the the the, the parrying. Jeb, Jabon22, I don't know if you're in, in chat, but I want to thank you very much for the follow. And I want to thank Captain Zanzibar for the raid. I'm like, I'm, I'm tickled. Um. Now, now if y'all notice... Um, there is a, um, if you notice that, um, for Beefcake, after the hits, the number for hits, you notice there's a plus sign. Does anyone have an, an idea why there is a plus sign? Any, anyone want to take a guess? You don't have to if you don't want to. But there is a plus sign in front of the hits. The monster surprised us. Now, of course, the, 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 as I mentioned before, the advantages of Murphy's ghosts are pretty good. Um, no special attacks, only two hit, two damage per uh, attack, and uh, no no special attacks. Now, there are two drawbacks, though. Um, they are, of course, um, they've got a good armor class, so they they can actually, you know. Um, they've got a good armor class, but also they they have a decent amount of hit points. Now, I'm not sure how this game does the calculations for the armor class, because I, I I played a game shard of spring where how 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 you did armor class is it didn't it did not affect your ability to hit, but what it did is it affected the damage. So in other words. Like if even if let's say you had a you had a weapon that could hit, you may you um so let's say you did maybe ten damage. Uh, but the but let's say the monster had an eight armor class of eleven, you essentially a ten minus eleven was negative, so you essentially did zero damage. And of course you have your like strength adjustments which is why I liked going up against some monsters because maybe they had like a high strength their weapons would be hands and so they may be they may hit you but they may only do like one or two damage uh, and in case no one guessed um, the plus is I, I'm, I'm uh, beefcake is wearing a regeneration item so they're we they're wearing a ring of regeneration so that's why they have the plus in front of them and how, how do we, how do we get such cool items such as rings of regeneration that, that's why we're going to do a level 2 grind at some point. We're going to do a level 2 grind where we're going to 
No, I mean level 10 grind, excuse me. Not level 2, Moody. Level 10 grind where we actually fight some fearsome monsters. Um, I think last last ta last stream I actually I actually encountered some greater demons. And by the way, if you encounter greater demons, run away, okay? Um, they they can do so much cray cray stuff to you. They can, I think they can like poison, they can paralyze. I think they can drain levels. I think they can even stone you. And besides, they cast spells, and they're not, they're usually not going to cast, oh, like the, um, um, like the, the, the minor fireball, um, minor fireball Halito spell. They're usually going to cast something nasty like Medalto or tilt wait Um, in case you're wondering, tilt wait is the, is, is basically the, the mother of all spells. And it, and it affects all monster groups. That's all right, Captain. Hey, lurk, lurk away. Lurk, lurk, lurk away, you know. Lurkers are welcome unless, um, unless you're a hostile lurker from Ultima Underworld or Ultima Underworld 2. And yes, they, they are an actual monster, so... Oh, if you're th people are thinking, oh, Moody's making a, 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 a joke. Yeah, I, I am making a joke, but it's also... drawback I have is that sometimes if you if you notice that the game freezes up a little bit it's not the game freezing up it's that I um that I have to if I want to type in chat I have to like switch windows another bit of news is I'm I'm actually you know, of course I'm not sh I'm not sure what I'm going to do the in the future but one thing I have thought about doing is I've actually thought about selling my house. I need to clean it up a lot, but the reason being is because um, the house next to me, I think, sold for like uh, um, about one hundred thirty thousand, about one hundred thirty-five thousand dollars. And I'm thinking I can get at least 125 for mine, which actually would be nice because it would, you know, I could pro I could use that money to pay off, to pay off a lot of stuff. You know, pay off my uh, my my car, the personal loan I have. I can maybe pay. You know, uh, I have some other things that I can uh, pay off. And I also think what I what I did to the house act, actually increased its value. Like the house has a probably a four or five year old um, AC, which is much more modern. Um, I, I also installed a reverse osmosis uh, a water softener, a reverse osmosis water filter. know that there is an ad break coming up so what I usually do during ad breaks is I usually I usually use it as a chance to um, uh, refill a drink go to the bathroom feel free to use it the same use do the same thing
Ad break is over, everyone. Just wanted to. Um, and, and by the way, those of um, uh, those, those of you who came in uh, through the raid and are still with me, you know, thank you. Um, you don't have to, but I always. Uh, one thing I always do is if um, um, if let's say I'm watching a channel that raids another channel, I always sit around for um, for a little bit, see what they're about. I'll be honest, there's probably been about 15 channels, I mean, maybe maybe not that many, maybe 10, where I've like liked liked the content so much I decided to follow. You know. But yeah, I actually do a lot of retro streaming, a lot of retro RPGs. Although I will say, considering considering when this game was made, the graphics are actually not too bad. Now, now I have a feeling, that being said, because Beat Cake has a um, device that, that's re that does regeneration, um, e each of these... Um, each there, there may only be one um, one Murphy's Ghost um, grind session because usually the the length of the grind session is dictated by once once a character hits like about 20 hit points uh, and usually that's Beefcake because Beefcake is the lowest total but because Beefcake has the um, ring of regeneration on. It, it may be longer. So we'll, 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 we'll play it by ear. See what happens. I hope the sound is okay. I'm trying to I'm trying to keep the the background music down because I've had a few people say that the that this music tends to be a little bit annoying. And by the way, if you're wondering why we're fighting friendly monsters, if you look at my um, classes, you'll see that four of the characters. Their class starts with an E. And what that means is evil. Or as Mermaid Mad would say, Evil! 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 Ah, oh, Iron Eyed Monk! I've been, I've been seeing it a little bit, but that, that's alright. Thank you. AI, cool. Oh boy, having it to have AI recreate Moody. That's that would be I would just love to see that. That would be funny. But I hope you're doing great this evening. I know, I know I'm I'm having a bit of a blast. Come on. And by the way, um for those of you in, in chat I like I like jokes, puns. Um, they, they're, all, they're all encouraged, so feel free. be honest with you I've, just, I've, I've been I've been kind of preoccupied a little bit but I, I kind of need to do a few fun things uh, maybe discord post a few things uh, 
Um, like one thing I've been thinking about is like fun fun ways to like fun ways to die in in a like a text adventure game, you know. Like fun ways to die in cuz that's I, I I grew up with with some of those. Like fun ways to die in Zork 1, fun ways to die in Zork 2. Zork one. It's just just because how the text handles it is. I, I, I was like, you know, like you're in the you're in a, in a room which which smells strongly of like gas. You know, you're in a gas room. So what I love to do is I just love to say, oh, we're in the gas room. Let's light a match. And, and I love I love at the computer's response. It's like. It, it, it is strange that someone would want to um, light a match in, in a room which which uh, which is which reeks strongly of coal gas, and then it says, "Fortunately, there is justice in the world," and it says, "Boom, you are dead." So, I, I just I just love that you know that response. Okay, now Ionite Monk, I do have to say something. It depends on whether you whether you go from whether you go from like a current like a current stream or if you go from like a stream that was that was before November. On uh, November of 2020, 2022, 2022 because um, back then I had longer hair. So I'd be curious to see if it's short hair moody or long hair moody. Okay, that's fine. Works for me. The only the only way you usually see long haired moody is if you like if someone like uh, threw clips or something. Wait a minute, that's funny. But if you look through clips, you won't get long hair moody. Because clips, clips are good for short hair moody. Get it? Clips, short hair, ah uh ha -huh. Um. Whoa, what was that? Oh, okay, crap. Oh, mm -hmm. Um. Um. I'm gonna, I'm gonna say something that actually happened about a couple hours ago. Well, I was like. You know, I, th I thought I had like a rat or mouse problem. And so I, I laid these glue traps. So I, la I laid some glue traps. The problem is, is that I actually, I accidentally stepped into one. And so now my, the shoes are, the shoes I have are like, have a bunch of like sticky stuff on them. So, and then there's sticky parts on the floor. Ugh, really moody, you know. So. I'm just gonna say, be be careful where you put them. Uh, but I would, um, and apparently I don't have a rat problem because I haven't caught one. 
It actually happened before. I had a, thought I had a rat problem before. And turns out I actually did, because I left and I came back and one of the glue traps happened to have a, uh, a small mou uh, a mouse caught in it. Beefcake's ever gotten hit. Okay. I just want to thank everyone. I'm actually tickled. This is like a, a just a pop-up stream. I just, eh, I just felt like, eh, want to stream. I just want to get this. As much as I love Wizardry One, I just want to get the, the the game over with. I think I'm up to episode 25, which is kind of funny because uh, I know another streamer does Wizardry 1, Base Jack 1, and I think they're, they're like in the mid-50s on episodes. And they stream once a week, so they've been, Base Jack's been going at it for over a year. Before I should, I, I let's, you know, thank. I want to thank Captain Zanzibar for the raid, but let's let's shout out Captain Zanzibar. You know, if you're not following Captain Zanzibar, does does a lot of does 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 some really cool gaming. I'd almost say maybe a bit of a variety streamer, but Captain, Captain does a lot of lot of pinball. Um. Captain's been recently playing uh, Zelda, the new, the newest Zelda, which I forget the name of it. You know, so. Murphy's Ghost Grind. And why, but in case you're wondering why we're doing this, it's because our party... The plan is to get our party, have each party member have at least 110 hit points. With 110 hit points, uh, we, can, we can withstand a tilt weight which... If you're on level 10, you could you could get some really nasty monsters such as um, spellcasters such as archmages who who would not who would not ha hesitate to cast tilt away. And so that's that's why you need that's why you need that's why we need to uh, get it up there. Also, of course, as you well know, higher levels mean uh, tend to mean better, better pot probability of hitting. And what we do is, as I said, we do Murphy's Ghost Grind, but then we also do an item grind. And what the item grind does is it, is we, we get some, uh, hopefully get some really cool items.
And though I'm telling you, those are the items that I'm really wanting. So in other words, if I had, and, and, you, and th those are, most of those you cannot get at like your local, like, um, Quickie Mart, you know, you actually have to go, you actually have to get, defeat some, uh, tough monsters. Um, the Lord's Garb gives me awesome, uh, awesome, uh, whatchamacallit, um, awesome XP, no, awesome uh, AC, not XP, Moody. Awesome uh, AC, it also has regeneration and has a lot of protection, so... So what that may mean is I may I may be I may be in um, I may like you know I can probably resist some spells. Muramasa blade is a really kick-ass weapon. Pardon my French. Uh, blade Cuisinart, pretty awesome weapon. Uh, Diadem of Malor, that's actually for the mage because mages can equip it. And, and actually, in if if, if there, you, what you need to do. I am using the PC lingo, so the lingo may not be the same for the um, for, for this variation. Uh, for the NES, they, they they have slightly different names, but I, I actually I actually know them. So when like I get let's say I get something like an Epe of Excellence, I'm like, oh okay, that's what it is. Actually, I actually did the math and, and found out and actually found out that if I can sell my home for a decent amount I could pretty much pay almost all pay off almost all of my debts so and cheese if it's mac and cheese send me some please send me some please captain and and no, knowing knowing y'all knowing y'all it's probably it's probably it's probably the good stuff all right that's all right dang. that's all right chill feel free to chill Oh, mac and cheese. Yeah. It, oh, and I'll tell you what. Especially if it's home. Um, especially if it's homemade. And when I when I say the ooh, when when I say the homemade, I mean the type where you um, uh, where you actually broil it for a few minutes. You put some cheese on the top and you broil it, so it's got that like cheesy crust on the top. Cheddar sounds good. Sounds delish. Okay, keep on going, Moody. Don't be surprised if I probably play this game tomorrow. You know, tomorrow I stream it tomorrow. I'm, I'm, I'm planning on doing a fitness stream at 7. I keep pushing it back, but I'm hoping that, you know, I just, tomorrow, tomorrow I have everything in, uh, in, um, have everything, have everything that I need.
Wow, Beefcake actually got hit. But look at that, Beefcake springs back to life. So... Alright, Iron Eyed Monk, you know, again, I, that's, um, get, you know, get a chance, I would, I would, I'd like to see it, I think, um, I'm not sure where you'd post it in Discord, though, you know, if you wanted to do that, or, y'all but it's like a lot of these companies are pushing app ordering I'm like so in other words for every restaurant I have to have a freaking app so I have to have like an Arby's app a Taco Bell app oh a mo a mo I mean really you know and, that, that's, and, and, and even worse is that some of these companies are like well because I'll tell you what, a few days ago, they had a Domino's $7.99 special carry out. So I went in and I'm like, I'd like $7.99 carry out. And they're like, uh, sorry, we can only get it online or on the app. So what I did is I'm like, okay, on my cell phone, I'm like, I actually went and ordered it online. But it's a hassle, you know. Same thing with a couple of Taco Bell items, you know, and even Mo Monday, you know, really. You know, I understand the app is easier, and and you know, and it you at least you at least um, and I can I can partly see it because you at least know, hey, we need we need to make this order. This person's coming soon. It's kind of like texting versus a, a phone call. You know, it's kind of like, you know. But still, you know, I'm like, really? Some of the companies are starting to get in a little bit of trouble because they're they're taking so many online orders that they're not able to keep up with like the um, you know like the in store people. going on longer than I thought.
it's, it's like this chick is like 72 out of 96. Beefcake, of course, is still full. Sorry for the burping, I'm like, eh. Finding Murphy's ghost, you know. And you know what I've always do? Almost every stream I, I grind Murphy's ghost, I'm like, you know, Moody, you should have at least taken the experience point when you started and then when you finished and, like, say, find out how many Murphy's ghosts did you kill, you know? But you never do that, Moody. You forget to do that, you know? You're not thinking today, okay? ghosts. Okay, just letting you know there is an ad break coming up. Um, so what I tell people is ad break is a chance to um, uh, get... If, you know, get, if you're actively watching, get something to drink, use the bathroom. I'm going to do the same thing. You know. So, feel free, feel free to take advantage of it. It's usually about every 30 minutes now, so... Okay, ad break is now over, so I'm I'm back. Um, just so let's keep let, let's can let's continue with our Murphy's Ghost grinding. 
Okay, now why I why I like Murphy's Ghost Grinding on level one because if I get surprised by monsters, they're usually not going to be a big deal. Okay, it's not like if I get surprised on level ten and I'm now like up against five uh, greater demons. And by the way, if you're if um, you have five greater demons, make like a cheerleader and split. Okay, so, um, so I don't know, I, I'm, I don't know if anyone uh, joined recently, but if you did, we're grinding Murphy's Ghost, good, good amount of XP, no special attacks, Murphy's Ghost can only do like two damage per attack, they, they do have a lot of hit points and they do have a good armor class, but honestly with, um, with uh, level 13, 14, 15, uh, fighters in the front, I think we're going to be alright. And if you look underneath me, you see the, um, you see the, um, all the characters. Um, you see the list of characters. And if you're wondering how, how those characters' names were determined, well, uh, when I started this game, I had a channel point redeem. Channel point redeem. I think 1,500, um, uh, 1500 mystery points. You could you could uh, name someone. I I I named it Beefcake. And by the way, Captain Zanzibar. I'm just gonna let you let you know that um, there is there is a there is a character I have as part of the rescue party. And guess what? Um, that one fight fighter was actually named after you, Captain. So. So just let you know that you were also named after, um, I and use your name as an inspiration for a character name. So. Yes, you are famous. Or you may be infamous, who knows. Tell you what, those of you at uh, Captain Zanspar's place, I don't know if the mac and cheese is ready yet, but if it's not, hope you get to enjoy it soon. I would just that actually sounds like that actually sounds like a really I'm gonna just say it's it just sounds like a pretty darn good meal. I mean, it's it's. I would say it's the perfect combo of protein and carbs. Maybe maybe a little bit more fat than you'd want, but still, you know, hey, you know, you need to live a little bit. I'm hoping 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 to talk about that during my stream. To, you know. Oh. doing the tattoo thing I, I just I just put a little bit of a um, just put a little bit of a pun about tattoos um 
Um, um, just a little warning, a little bit of, um, um, maybe not a not popular opinion about tattoos. This is just my opinion. I think they're a little bit, dis little, uh, they're distracting. Again, I, I, I do have ASD tendencies, so I tend, you know, sensory overload. Um, now I'm gonna just say this. It's like, you know, like small ones, they're not bad. But when you when you do like, like when you do like an entire, let's say, you know, like arm or whatnot, I mean, I just, I'm, I, I just find it distracting. But, and that being said. I'm, I'm not I'm not one to get tattoos because I, I want they're, they're, they they tend to be permanent you know tend to be permanent so Murphy's ghost grind here it's like it's like you, you usually about this by this time I'm usually like oh let's go back to the castle but no we're like this could be a case where we could be like you know like we could have one Murphy's ghost grind cheese graters to remove tattoos darn so I, th I think now nowadays what they do is they they use lasers uh, to do tattoo removal so I mean, that being said, I'm just going to say, I don't know if I've ever been stung with a, a laser, but that, that, that can be, I, I think that can be a little bit, you know, worrisome. Thanks, Captain. Let you know, a tiny one. As I, as I said, I'm not. You know, when they when tattoos get to the point where they're like super distracting, I'm like, you know, uh, you know, I'm sorry. I think you overdid it. You know. Maybe the discombobulator ray will remove the tattoo. Ionite monk, I'm not, for some reason that sounds, I'm trying to remember, I think for some reason that sounds something like, something that came from Spongebob Squarepants. Maybe not the, the I mean the, the, the cartoon, not, not Spongebob itself, but, you know, that, that's, that sounds, that sounds like a Spongebob, something from a Spongebob episode. later Ray. <laughs> oh, 
Sandy's teleporter machine. I'll say this, good old, good old, good old Sandy, you know. And I have to say something about uh, Spongebob. I think the first episode was, was 1999. Just to say, that any, any cartoon that can at least last, um, last over, tw uh, over 20 years... I mean, I'm impressed. I'm not sure about Family Guy, but I know South Park's... South Park and Simpsons are over 20 years. As well, I'm so, um, sorry. Sorry, the games stopped. I had to, I had to put some, wanted to put something in chat. But if anyone remembers Wacky Races, the old version, um, they, they, they were on Boomerang. I was like, I just channel surfing, trying to find something fun. Yeah, he's like, Wacky Races, like, oh. It's the 2018 version. I was like, wait a minute, wait a minute. Now you go, oh, cool. And I, I, I was just like stoked. I, I just was like, I, I wish I had found it. There was only about like seven minutes left in the episode. I wish I had like found it earlier. So I could have like enjoyed it. Yeah, that was fun. Oh yeah, Boomerang, they, cause they, old Boomerang, they have some really cool stuff. They have like the, some of the, uh, some of the, the Scooby-Doo episodes, which I like. They have, they, they, they have a good mix. Um, of course they, there was a new Looney Tunes, but they, they have some of the, like the older Looney Tunes. You know, now it remind, remind me like the, the old, good old foghorn leghorn, you know, boy, I'm speaking to you, son. You know, you need to pay attention, son. You really think you're getting into that hen house with your, your you know. Now, I'll, ju I'll just say this about some of the, a lot of the cartoons. There is no way that, that uh, a fair number of the cartoons that they could show without having some type of like warning saying you know it's like pork you know with porky pig having a stutter you know saying hey you know or whatnot captain that that being said I am gonna say this the you know I have to I have to defend Roadrunner I have yet to meet someone that wanted to go to the desert and drop an anvil on a roadrunner, okay? You know, it's like, so they're saying, oh, cartoons are bad influence. No. I have yet to meet someone like that. You 
Now that being said, if I could somehow pick up an anvil, I'd, I, I, I'll tell you what, I'd be freaking impressed. Okay, we're still going on with the Murphy's Ghost grinding. It's like we're, we're, we're talking about a lot of stuff. And, and by the way, feel free, hey, post, if you want to you know, post a joke in the, post a joke pun in the, the chat, you know? As long as as long as it's not like racist, homophobic, or whatnot, you know, I don't mind. Oh yeah, I, yeah. It was like cable, and you know, watch Cartoon Network. Oh yeah. Cartoon Network, and I, 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 I remember, I remember, I even remember, and it was funny because, you know, you know, when I was in college, you know, I think those Cartoon Network was broadcasting Inspector Gadget a lot, and I, I remember we had like, so it was like whenever, whenever like we were broadcasting Inspector Gadget, I had like three or four other people from like the the residence hall come on in it's like yeah what's watch let's have a watch party <laughs> you know we, we used to have watch parties about the you know cartoons that was so much fun these like um, encounters again you're, you're like why um, why are we grinding because because we've got some uh, characters that could that could get wiped out with a single tilt to weight spell now usually keep in mind that usually tilt to weight the average damage is like 60 to 90 but what if, what if, let's say, you happen to have a character that's like gets 110 damage, and and they die? That's that's the last thing you want to do. You want to have a, you, you don't want to have a dead character like in the in the maze. As you can see, Beefcake got like, you know, got some hit points lo loss, and guess what? They're already back. They're all they're, Beefcake's already back to like regular hit points. Well, not quite. Well, Beefcake is now. So I'll tell you what. That ring of regeneration for Beefcake is working very nicely. So you know what we need to do? 
we need to get rings of regeneration for everyone. Let's say Oprah is like, you get a ring of regeneration, you get a ring of regeneration, you get a ring of regeneration, you get a ring of regeneration. Everyone gets a ring of regeneration. Now, um, what, what I'm going to do now is I'm going to do a little bit of a flex of my right arm. Okay. Now, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna let you a little secret. Um, I actually took. Wow, darn. Okay. I actually um I actually took some measurements. And unfortunately, my arm arm measurement is actually there is actually way low. game really I'll tell you what I have a feeling the way the stream is going it's probably it may only be just like one one Murphy's Ghost grind and then one like a uh, level 10 grind because I'll tell you what you know with be, be, because beefcake keeps keeps healing we don't have to worry about like healing beefcake so So we're, we're just we're just doing our Murphy's Ghost grinding. Um, FYI, some uh, like I I talked about glue traps for mice and rats, and I have a feeling that my problem was that the, the next door's neighbor's dog. Maybe was was in my yard because let's just say I had a few I had a few lawn ornaments and unfortunately I don't own a dog so I'm like they could not now I, I could not prove that it was like my next door neighbor's dog that was in my yard but now I actually have I actually have some windows open so I can catch them. I'm not trying to be a meanie. You're like, oh, Moody, you're trying to be a jerk to your neighbors. No. I'm just saying, if their their dog is in my yard, it, need, it does not need to be in my yard. I just want to be able to give them proof and say, hey, fix this. Because can I reveal a dark secret about me? Good, I'm a good person, but if let's say you you happen to wrong me, you can you wrong me. I I can I can really not I am I can really be petty, and I I I'm one of those that that you know that's very that's very I hate to say it I can be diabolical. So in other words, I I can be one of those that can be like ah. Um, 
and, and I'm gonna just say this: if anyone follows South Park, I I can I can be like um, I don't know I don't know if you know Eric Cartman. I'm not fat. I'm big boned. Eric Cartman is I I would if anyone if anyone uh, I would say Eric if any if if Eric Cartman had a a D and D alignment, it would be lawful evil. Because Eric Cartman can, can come up with some really cray-cray stuff. Um, just remember, let's rem remind you of the episode about Eric Cartman and, uh, and Scott Tennerman. You have to watch it. There is an ad break that's coming up soon. So, just letting you know. So what happens once the ad break starts? I'm gonna let you all know. You use that time to hit the bathroom, hit something else, etc. Okay, ad break is now over, so let's continue with our Murphy's Ghost grind. So apparently we're going to keep going to either just this chick or Jalimni get down to like 20 hit points. So...
Now, by the way, as I said, so. Okay, so I'm just letting y'all know that we're, we are gonna we are there's so a, after the Murphy's Ghost grind, do not leave because we will be doing a level 10 item grind. I actually think that's a little more fun because we fight there we fight some nasty monsters, you know. We could we have the potential to fight some really nasty monsters. And we're not sure how many grind sessions we're gonna do, you know, it depends on how how I feel. By the way, to just FYI, Tuesday I'm actually going to Bloomington. Um, I ac I actually have a um, I'm actually getting some uh, uh, rust proofing on my car. Um, Z Bart, I actually when when I bought my car, and this is the thing, you know. So, so, you know, because I, I was, I was in an accident and I actually called the, 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 the place I usually, I've bought three cars from them and I say, this is what I want, okay? Because I know how you do things. So I'm going to say, don't. I told them what I wanted. And so things actually went a lot smoother because I was like, I didn't, I didn't do any of the upsells, you know. Because what they'll do, like if you go to a dealership, you know, they'll they'll be like, okay, let's do, we're gonna do financing. You know, they talk like financing. Uh, they often talk about like the four squares. Honestly, that's that's why I'd never make it at a car dealership because I'd rather be honest. I'd, I'd rather be honest, but like I want to convince people to take it, you know. You know, and so so when I went to uh, car, refinance to uh, get a new car, I'm like. It went quickly because I'm like, this is, I told you, this is what I wanted. Don't bullshit me. I'm not afraid to walk away. I told him that. I'm like, hey. So, you know, it's, you know, keep in mind, be, be educated. Yeah. You know, as I said, just, just be informed, you know, okay, go, go in, do your research. I'll tell you what, a lot, lot, of, lot of dealerships, they also have internet people. So, you know, talk, talk, talk to them over the internet. You know, when I, when I negotiated, I, I did most of my negotiation via email. Like, you know, and so when I, when I actually did the test drive, I'm like, I know what I'm driving. You know, it was like, okay, I made... I just want to drive, test drive the car, make sure that it's good, that it's you know nothing wrong with it.
I'll be honest with you, I'm one of those rare people. I, I'm probably I'm one of those that I don't I tend not to respond to high pressure tactics. I, I, will, I hate to keep bringing up that I have ASD, but I'm one of those that I would rather, you know, I want to say, give me time, give me time to think about it. And, th and that's why, that's why I, people don't like, you know, people started to kind of like not cold call me. Because I don't do well with cold calling, you know, if you're trying to sell me something, I'm like... Because I've had companies say, oh, we do this, and, you know, I'm like, no, no. Direct me to your website, and then I'll make a decision later. And I'll be honest with you, they hate that. They, they, they want to make the sale now. Like, Maybe what I need to do is maybe I need to be like, okay, you know, you know, have a division of the company that deals with people who, people who have ASD, you know. You know, people who would rather, you know, take time, you know. And I'm kind of the same way. It's like, don't try to push a product on me. You know, try to convince me to sell it to you. You know, convince me. And I try to do the same thing, like, in my stream. I'm like, you know, hey, if you want to follow, go ahead and follow. But don't, don't, don't follow just because someone says, oh, follow Moody Mystery. You know, follow because you like the content. Even if you don't like the content all the time, you can say, hey, I'll follow. And by the way, following is free. That being said, I need to get different games. Okay, I'm about to post something in chat. say there's something I'm debating you know one one thing I like is I, I like when uh, I like when streamers do regular schedules and have certain things that they do so for example like let's say every Tuesday is a uh, is an Atari game you know or like they'll say hey on Thursdays we're gonna we're doing Commodore 64 or like Saturdays we're doing Fortnite do you like that, or would uh, do you like a really set schedule, or would you rather have a, um, or would you, or, or would you rather have like a, a fle like a more flexible schedule? <laughs> like, do, do you, you, you like? I, I'm see, I'm trying to decide what I want to do. Part of me wants to do like a regular schedule. There's also a part of me that wants to be like, hey, you know. Now, when you say ske set schedules, blind immortal, do you mean like I'm gonna stream this, this, and this day, or do you say, or or is it a case of where you're saying if I'm gonna stream this on Monday, I'm gonna stream this on this day, th that on that day, and um. I don't know on another day, you know, because a sketch, a set schedule could mean, hey, I'm, I'm streaming, I'm streaming these days at this time. Okay, hold on. Um, um, I'm 
actually, what I'm gonna do... Okay. I'm actually, don't mind me, I'm actually gonna write down... I'm gonna write down what you mentioned. Captain Zanzibar and Blind Immortal, I want to thank you. Thank you very much for the feedback. You've actually given me some ideas. And what I mean by ideas is like you've um, um so you you um. So what it seems like what you're saying is, hey, put up a you know put up a schedule. Tell everyone what, what you're streaming. You know, saying, hey, you know, and, and be, be be specific. You know, be, be specific. Don't you know, like don't, you know, don't just say retro. You know. I, th I think a set schedule without, but but I mean I'm also gonna say this. I think I think maybe uh oh. Zanzibar, but I think in my case, if I want, if I want to, if I want to, if I want to do, oh, I, I, <laughs> I, I, li I like this, the shroom work for Zanzibar, the only drawback was, Know, is is that sometimes the the um, um, the um, there were there were like connectivity issues, but I'll tell you what, you know. But but I I, I I appreciate the feedback. I think maybe what I need to do is maybe I just need to you know not only um, have a set schedule, well not not a super set schedule, but even if I don't have a set set schedule, you know, at least c communicate it in advance. Or or maybe or maybe like um, you know, like have have day, have days of the week where I do certain things. You know, I used to do that a while back, and it was nice, but. But unfortunately, my mental health declined, and so I kind of was like, eh. I'm not saying whatevs, but I kind of like got into that mode.
I will say, Captain's Captain, though, truer words are spoken because, you know what? I'm, I'm just going to say this. And I, I, this is why, this is why I, lo I love watching your streams because if you're doing something that you enjoy, you know, it's, your enthusiasm is going gonna, is gonna to show. And it's like, hey, this person is this person's really loving what they do. Let's watch them, because they're, they're having fun. And see, that's what it's all about. I'm going to just say this. It's all about having fun. Which is why maybe I've been playing the Wizardry 1 so often, because I'm having so much fun with it. the grinding it's like hey it's like because I am having fun I'm talking I'm talking fun to people we're having fun and thank you I, I'm, I'm glad you love watching the retro games you know it's, it's like I said and I also try to be educational I don't you know but not in a not in a bad way, okay? People think, oh, he's the Moody's being educational. No, I'm trying to be I'm trying to be educational and like a non-threatening, you know? Like, hey, this is why I'm doing this. This is why, you know? It's like. So why why are you as like why are you targeting Murphy's ghost? Hey, you know good XP. XP is important. Yeah, and I will uh, the older games I will say this were brutal because because a lot of the um, especially the Ultima series. I think the Ultima series and a few of the Wizardry series, they were brutal because it wasn't a case where you had to, uh, where, you, where, where you had to like, oh yeah, you know, where you, you, you really had to be like, oh yeah, I, I have to, you know, it reminds me of Ultima 3 when I when I would grind by going into the dungeons. You know, like going to the first level and be like fighting monsters and then like getting a chest. Because a lot of times, especially those old games, you needed lots of gold. I know, I know Ultima 2, you needed lots of gold, because you were like, oh yeah, pretty much, you know, you, had to, you needed gold to get to the, um, is it, yeah. Oh yeah, the old school controllers, you know, a lot of them were not fun. And, and Blind Immortal, I will say this, especially with, like, diagonal moves. Because there was a lot of times, like, you know, like, like let's say you had, you had to do a diagonal move. You know, whether it be in, like, a gauntlet. You know, or, like, let's say Star League Baseball, where you wanted to, like, you know, throw a certain pitch. And you had to do diagonal. I mean, it, it just didn't work.
Okay, sorry, I have to use the bathroom. I know it's a little bit before the ad break, but it's bathroom time, so... Okay, thank you, Ionite Monk, for a couple. I'll have, to, I'll have to look at those, but I'm not going to look at those. Um, yes, I do have a Discord, um, Captain. the discord yet so I'm kind of like you know I'm concentrating oh retro pixel art one is far more fitting I'll have to look at those I mean as I said right now I'm streaming so Yes, Captain, I do have a Discord, so I put I put it in a link. game I'll be running for the next nine weeks. Is that like D and D? Cause I'll tell you if it's, if it's D and D, that's pretty cool. Pretty cool, blind and moral. I like to say, yep, dice rolling. Ah, you know what? I'm just gonna throw this out there. People think D and D is like roll, rolling a bunch of dice. You know, that's all you do. No, I mean, this, I, there's there's a lot of creativity that goes into it. Like as a DM, I don't know if you're a DM blind and mortal, but. but a lot of times, like dice is like. It's like okay, we just we just need to determine. You know, we use dice to determine the results. It's, it's, 
I'll tell you what, that's, you know, I, I've actually seen a lot of um, arguments about what lingo, like, so if someone's running, like, a Dungeons and Dragons, what should they be called? It's like, you know, it's like, are they the DM, G, you know? Okay, there is another ad break coming up, so. Ad break is over, so we're gonna still continue. Um, uh, blind immortal. I, you know, and I'm just, I, I'm just gonna throw this out um, as a suggestion. Okay, I'm just going to throw this out at you D&D &D players. Um, this is, this is, because I, I actually was asked to do this a while back. A lot of times the DM, GM, the person who's running the game, also directs the monster's actions. So what I want to do is like have the, the the person who's like the DM or GM person running the game. They're just a referee. But have have a second person who who's responsible for uh, the monsters. So in other words, like maybe, let's say I'm the DM. I maybe have a friend. You know, I maybe have a friend who's like, you know, and, 
and so and so what could happen is they could you know you, I, I, I like I just like that idea it's like because you, you don't want to have a person who's the DM and also trying to control the monsters because you can do it you often can get a PT, uh, TPK. Narrator, yeah, I like that. Cause they're they're, they're the one that's telling the story. It's like Okay, so it looks like this chick is getting close down to the um uh down uh, close. player's opportunity to fail, you know, hey, that being said, it's a lot of time, oh, why did you fail, well, you know, I tried to do this, I tried to do that, you know, don't. So this, what, so what we're gonna do? Captain Zanzibar going to do it, be a lurk. I uh, I tell you what, it would have been cool if you um, use the lurk, the exclamation per point lurk command, but that's all right. Because I actually do have a lurk command. Yes, not yes, Captain. I had to, I had to, I had to do the uh, mellow lurker from uh, Ultima Underworld One. Yes, yes, there is a. Once this chick gets to um, uh, t uh, below 20 hit points, we're going to uh, we're going we're going to head back to the castle. We're going to level up, and then we're going to do another another you know what. We're going to do another. Uh, we're going to do another. We're, we're, we're going to do another. Sorry, Moody. Keep it. We're, we're, so we're gonna we're gonna do another level ten grind. So why do we keep on picking on this Murphy's ghost? Good experience. No special attacks. Um, only does two damage per attack. Drawbacks. Good good AC. Armor class. Good. A good bit of hit points, but notice the word we're really doing wow, we're really kicking the butt here.
I'll tell you what, I'm, I'm actually, up, thank, I want to just say thank you everyone for watching and viewing. I know this grinding is not exciting, but still, hey. But I'm hoping I'm at least providing entertainment. be like in um almost be like a like a chatting stream Shig is Limney. Well, oh, hey, Boxy, how you doing this evening? You're doing great. Thank you for coming on in. Thank you for coming on in. I love. Oh, goodness, great to see you. Chatting and do whatever. <laughs> well, I'm just gonna say this blind immortal. My my concern about just chatting is that it doesn't really give you a lot of information, you know. You know, if you if you see my if you see me and you say. Oh, he's doing Wizard We Won. You at least know what I'm up to. But just chatting could be almost anything, you know? And, I, and I'd rather be more transparent about what I'm doing rather than be like, oh yeah, let's, let's hide it from everyone. Let's just do just chatting. Okay, this chick, you need you need to get down to 20 hit points because I want to go back. To, I want to go back to the to the darn castle and get some level ups. Okay, this chick, you need to do that. Okay, really, this chick, because I also want to do a um, I also want to do a uh, I also want to do like a um, a level 10, you know, stream, you know, level 10. game really game are you gonna are you just, are you gonna be a darn jerk okay this, this game is getting you know this game's getting uh Welcome everyone in. I'm John Moody of uh, Moody Mystery. Uh, I, got, I got some more viewers. I want to explain a few things. So why am I grinding Murphy's Ghost? Murphy's Ghost. One. No special attacks. Only, only hits once for two damage, and good experience points. Um, 
um, drawbacks to Murphy's Ghost. Um, good AC, uh, AC armor class. And, um, and they do have, good, Murphy's Ghost do have a good bit of hit points. So if you see if you see a plus next to Beefcake, Beefcake has a regeneration ring. Also, if you look at the status, uh, you may see fight, 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 parry, parry, parry. It's because that only the first three characters can uh, melee. Characters 4 through 6 can't melee, uh, but they can cast spells or whatnot. But they won't. They won't cast spells. Okay. Okay, so this chick is down to 24. So this chick is getting getting low on hit points. So what we're going to do is after this, we're going to go back to the town. And then we're going to, um, and then we're going to go to level 10. Boxy, yeah, let's smash that Murphy's ghost, yeah. Well, we've been smashing Murphy's ghost for a while, so. Thank you, Boxy. I'm glad you have me on on a cool monitor. still grinding Murphy's ghost because this chick is still hasn't hit oh this chick has hit 20 you know what, let's, let's 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 take this chick down to 18 okay so what we're gonna do is we're gonna say once this chick has 18 we're gonna we're gonna make like a cheerleader and split So what we're looking for is we're looking for this chick to get below 20. Okay, it happened. Okay, so we're gonna, we're 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 going back to the castle. Castle. We're back in the castle again. Okay. I'm not gonna take him up, but we're gonna be like, okay. So Lord. So you have Monty. So you're you're gonna um, you're gonna cure this chick. So we're gonna we're 
gonna say this one. So let's say the state. I always like to say the state. Okay, so we're gonna leave. So, so everyone's good. So, what we're gonna do. So what we're gonna do, so we're gonna, we're gonna do Adventurers in. Okay, so let's do Adventurers in. Leaf cake. bad news. We gained IQ. We gained piety. We gained vitality. We gained agility. We gained love. We gained our... Oh, really? You gained freaking one hit point? Seriously? Whatevs. Okay. Uh, so. Beefcake? You're now level 16, and yet you gained one effing hit point. Really? Really, you piece of crap? Okay. Freaking gained 58 hit points. kidding me 58 hit points really really game 58 hit points <laughs> but, better not get level drained I'm like I'm stunned. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm stunned. <sighs> okay, so Jalimni. Okay, so the, um, so our cleric did get a level, but only got one hit point. I'm not, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna worry too much, so. So Jeff got another hit point. So got another level and got five hit points. 
Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to go back. We're, gonna, we're, 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 gonna, we're actually going to go back to Gilgamesh's Tavern. Let's inspect everyone. Uh, so, level, level, level 16. Chick is level 14. Oh. Oh, but see, this chick has. Uh, this chick has every team vitality, so I can see why this chick maybe got a lot of, you know what. So let's have it. Let's inspect you only. Vitality only 16, so. I'll tell you what, pretty good stats for the cleric. Pretty good stats for the cleric, so. Let's see, Jeff. Jeff has some pretty awesome stats. So I better be careful. Okay. Okay, we're going to soon be item grinding level 10, so. I'm just going to say, hey. I do want to save the state, though, so. So what we're going to be doing is we're going to be item item grinding. This is going to be our last grind. I do want to do something adventure again. Oh, I like celebrating her birthday. Hey, there is an ad break coming up, coming up soon. I'm, I'm, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to pause a little bit here. So, right now, we are actually, as far as we are concerned, all, all, yeah. Perfect timing. Go grab coffee, the blind immortal. That's why I tell you about an ad break coming up soon. Get some coffee. You know, use the bathroom. It, it, it's a bit. It's a bit of a break. And uh, I, I 
like to inform people of that. You know, like inform people, hey, ad break coming up. So. We're, we're, the next, the next, um, next, um, sorry. I'm sorry I'm rocking back and forth because I have to go to the, oh. Okay, ad break is over, y'all. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to, um, okay, so. Now we're going to do the level 10 grind. So. Okay. So. We're going to do, we're going to do Edge of Town. Maze. So inspect. The cleric. Oh shit. Okay. The cleric is going to cast. My perfect. It's going to help with the AC. But the cleric is also going to cast Latumopic. That helps us identify monsters. Okay, so we're going to go to Jeff. Yeah. So, Maller. So we're going to do 8, 1, 8. Okay, so we're here. So we go down a chute. Okay, so so we're actually down on level ten now. We're down on level ten. We're 
So, what we're trying to do is we're trying to get some cool items. We want some uh, Lord's Garb. Okay, oh yeah, Lord's Garb. Bad, 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 bad. Okay, so. Now, be, we have to be careful because thing is, who knows what we're going to encounter. <sighs> Crap. We have poison giants and a will-o'-the-wisp. Now, I'm just going to throw this out at you. This is actually not a bad... This is actually not a bad encounter. Okay? So what we're going to do... Is we're going to... We're going to... Oh boy. We're going to fight the poison giants. Okay, so... Okay. Now the problem is the poison giants can breathe. Okay. So we have to be careful. Okay. So we're gonna we're gonna do a mock canito. I I think mock canito can kill the poison giants. Let's try to continue. Let's try to sleep the poison giants, and let's let's do let's let's do another machinito. Okay, now this really went too quickly. I, I need I need to adjust the timing, but we're we're only go we're going against a will o' the wisp now. As far as a will o' the wisp is concerned, they um, the, the, the good the will o' the wisps have have a ridiculous armor class, okay? So you can't hit them, and they have a good number of hit points, but they cannot do special attacks. Okay, so they, they actually they actually gave us about twenty eight thousand XP. Okay, so so we're gonna calfo calfo. Okay, clerics crisis. Gas bomb. Hmm. Crap. Okay, so we're gonna ninja. Our ninja's gonna do cleric's crisis. Ooh. Now you notice the message came up. You could not disarm it. What that means is, it is indeed a cleric's crisis. So the fact we, we we did get a clerics crisis. Okay, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna save the state and we're gonna say, hey, you know what? Okay, we had, we got we we got a random encounter with vampires. You know what?
run. You notice that I ran from the vampires, okay? Because vampires will drain levels. And that and that's the last thing we need. Do we really want to be having monsters that drain levels? The horse says, Nay! Now, unfortunately, we did not get a lot of good stuff from the um, previous encounter. So, because I think we only got like a scroll. So what we're going to do is we're going to, we're going to be like, you know. Now that being said, depending on the scroll, if it's a scroll of Mahdi, we, we, we'd love to have it. Ooh, Frost Giants. Guess what we're going to do? Makinito again. Um, so we're going to parry, but... Um... Because one thing we know about frost giants is that they are cla they are actually classified as level one monsters. So in other words, so in other words, what that means is so what's this? Now notice that we got lucky. In the two encounters we had, we actually had got about 55,000 experience because we actually got lucky with the monsters. Poison needle. Gas bomb. Really? So we have a crossbow bolt, poison needle, and a freaking gas bomb. Can't you make up your darn minds? Okay. Let's let's have the ninja inspect it. <sighs> really? So, okay. I'm just going to save this because because who knows what could happen. <sighs> so you had poison, uh, poison needle, crossbow bolt, gas bomb, teleporter. Really? You know what? Y'all suck, okay? Really? Really, character is okay? Is that the best you can do? Come on, I hire. Uh, maybe I just need to disband my party and be like, okay, y'all go home. I'm just going to get some level one noobs that can do better than you, you know? Okay, so. Disarm, what should we go? So, which spell should we do freaking pick? Come on, Moody. Do better. No, maybe I just, maybe I just need to, no. Maybe I just need to, like, freaking go home and be like, 
Screw you guys, I'm going home. Okay. So what we're gonna do is uh, we're gonna we're gonna go with a gas bomb. Oh, cool. We got, we got, we got poison needle. I'll tell you what. I'm good with poison needle. Okay, so, go to the edge of town. Maze. Okay, so. Got Jalimni and this chick. Okay, so so I think I think we're good. So let's so let's see Jalimni. No. There. So we're gonna get we're gonna give this and this to toast. Okay, so let's see what we get. Nope, because we wanna camp. Let's see what Toast has. So, identify. Neutral, ooh, neutral plate, okay. Okay, so, neutral, what is neutral plate? So neutral plate, let's see, so let's go up, so what are we going to do, we're going to go go to mashes, so toast, So what Toast is going to do is Toast is going to give the neutral, let's see. Okay, no, no, no. So Toast, let's give the neutral plate to this chick. Okay, still the same. Okay, so what we're going to do... Um, let's, let's have Toast go to the, um, so let's go to the Adventurer's Inn because, hey, Oh, 
Oh, toast is like close. Okay, so. So let's save the let's save the state again. Let's let's go back. Let's go back down. Hey. You never know. Maybe hey. Maybe 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 we'll get lucky again. I just want to thank everyone for watching me. I'll tell you what. I I'm just tickled. I'm just I'm just I'm, I'm glad like everyone's like Okay, so cleric And lot to mopic so we can identify the monsters. <laughs> Murphy's when <laughs> she should tickle them for one. Sorry, that's an expression like when you say like when I say I'm tickled that everyone's watching, it's like I'm glad everyone's watching. Okay, so let's 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 um, let's mail her down, okay, Moody. So let's save this. Let's save the state. I just like to save the state. Hope everyone's doing well, you know? So, it's time for item grinding, okay? Ooh! Nicely done. We surprised the monsters. We have five master ninjas. So, hmm. Okay. Now. When we when we uh, when we surprise monsters, we cannot cast spells, but what we can do, we can use items. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna have the um, I'm gonna have the the fighters. He can fight, fight, fight. Let's see what we have to use. Ooh, ring of suffocation, but I don't think that'll work. So we're gonna we're gonna parry, okay? So we actually killed three of the five Naster ninjas. So what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna parry, fight, fight. Parry, 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 but I'm gonna spell. I'm gonna do Madalto. Now let's do Madalto. We actually don't have to worry about Madalto because we killed the killed the Master Ninjas. So, let's do Kalfo and let's hope that we don't get like three different answers, okay? Kalfo, Poison Needle. Okay, so you know what? Don't ask me. I have a feeling it's a Poison Needle. Do you think it's a Poison Needle? Yes, we think it's a poison needle, Moody. Darn, poison needle. Oh, 
Okay. I was hoping to cure the poison needle. Okay, so what we need to do... Oh boy. Okay, so... So now we, we... This is a random encounter, which we don't like. So, 